Are there any legal or ethical issues with searching for or viewing Boku no Pico content online? Hello everyone. Today we're going to discuss a topic that might be a bit controversial. The potential legal and ethical issues associated with searching for or viewing specific anime content online. The anime we're discussing today is, Boku no Pico. It's crucial to understand the context and laws surrounding media consumption, especially when it comes to anime with explicit content. What is Boku no Pico? Boku no Pico is a Japanese series of adult anime OVAs, original video animation, produced by Natural High. It is often considered controversial due to its explicit content involving underage characters. Due to its nature, this anime has been subject to numerous discussions concerning both its legal and ethical standing. Is it legal to watch Boku no Pico? From a purely legal standpoint, the answer to this question depends on the laws in your country or region. Some countries have strict regulations regarding explicit content, especially when it involves underage characters, even if those characters are animated or fictional. For example, in certain jurisdictions, such as the United States, Canada, and the UK, laws are in place that criminalize the possession, distribution, or creation of certain types of explicit content featuring minors, even if those minors are fictional characters in anime or manga. Other countries may have less stringent rules. It's essential to be aware of and understand your local laws before searching for or viewing content like Boku no Pico. Ignorance of the law does not excuse any illegal activities. Are there ethical concerns? On the ethical side, viewing content like Boku no Pico can raise many concerns. Some people argue that because the characters are fictional and no real person is being harmed, it shouldn't be an issue. However, others believe that such content can normalize harmful behaviors and attitudes, and therefore is ethically problematic. Ethics can be subjective, and what's considered acceptable varies significantly from person to person, culture to culture. Thus, while someone might find watching this type of content acceptable, others might strongly object due to their ethical standpoint. In conclusion, whether it's legal or ethical to search for or view Boku no Pico online largely depends on your local laws and personal ethics. It's important to stay informed about the laws in your country and understand the potential ethical implications of viewing such content. Remember, being a responsible consumer of media is an essential part of being a respectful member of the anime community. Stay safe and be responsible.